Well, for the first time in more than 20 years, a fully crewed Navy ship is in port at Mare Island. KPIX 5's John Ramos shows us the ship and her crew got a hero's welcome as they came in. It's been a while since Vallejo's waterfront has seen this much activity on a weekday afternoon, not since the Mare Island shipyards closed in 1996. But today, the crowds returned to welcome home an old friend. After 22 years, the Navy was back. You don't see this every day. We're not in wartime. So to see this coming in is just a spectacular sight. The USS Emory S. Land is one of only two submarine tenders currently operated by the Navy. And though it has come to Mare Island for repairs and maintenance, the crew treated the crowd to the full ceremony, lining the decks dressed in their traditional dress whites. Dwayne Fontaine actually served on this very ship 35 years ago. Do you remember those days when you used to pull into port and be standing at attention? You know, I don't know. We did. I don't know if we did the full dress like this. <laughs> I think the captain really wasn't. They're just that. doing that for Vallejo's yeah, sake. I think so. <laughs> it seems this was a display of mutual respect. Vallejo struggled after the Navy pulled out, but lately Mare Island has seen a rebirth with mixed-use commercial activity in the old buildings. The mayor hopes today's arrival will be more good news. That's what we're hoping. They received a, a $16 million contract from the U.S. government to do work. So we believe that there will be more work coming. There have been other Navy ships here since the base closed, but never with a crew aboard. So it was nice to have the land arrive with some good guys to cheer for. It's been a while since you had sailors on leave walking the streets of Vallejo. Are you, are you prepared for that? I, I, I do believe we are. I think they're going to find Vallejo a, a fascinating a town, a very welcoming. And that's what this is all about. In Vallejo, John Ramos, KPIX 5. Now, the crew of more than 300 sailors will be in Vallejo for about 100 days uh, while that ship is in dry dock. One third of them will always be aboard.